That was Brooke Leiterwood with, of course, Honey on in the Rock. Here on your radio station, AM 930, The Light Edmonton's Positive Talk. Well, I came across a really great quote today when it came to fathers. It says, dads, make sure that you children know, yes, you make mistakes, but don't mistake your love when you give it to them. So basically what this quote is saying is, Dad, your kids are going to know that you are not human. And one of the greatest things that you can do is admit when you make a mistake. That was the one question or the one quality that my wife reminded me about was the fact he says, listen, Robert Dean, you're going to make mistakes, but own up to them, especially with your kids. And so that was something that both my wife and I have tried to do. When we have wronged our kids for whatever reason it is, we simply say, we're sorry, we make mistakes. And the one thing about children, no matter what their age is, they're going to forgive. You know why? Because you have taught them the power of forgiveness. You see, when we forgive, often we think it is for the benefit of someone else, but it's actually our own benefit. Because when we forgive, what we're doing is we are releasing ourselves from the offense, but also as well, we're clearing the channel for God to bless us in our life situation. Jesus put it so succinctly in the Sermon on the Mount when he says, listen, if you're not willing to forgive, then you're blocking your relationship of God forgiving you. Because with the same manner that you have been forgiven, God expects you to forgive others. Remember, God forgave you of all your sins. When you give your life to Jesus Christ, basically from that moment forward, all the sins behind have been forgiven. And when you, of course, are aware of what's going on in your life and you ask for forgiveness, well, God is faithful and just to forgive you of your sins and cleanse you from all unrighteousness. So basically, as a father, when you come in and say, listen, kid, I really, really blew it. And the child will say, yeah, dad, okay, no problem at all. And the relationship is restored. And you guys are walking together again. And the love is flowing. Also as well, make sure that your kids are cognizantly aware of the fact that you love them. Show them practically that you love them. And always remember, Number one responsibility of dad is, of course, to be a role model and a example as well. You do that by not only how you talk, but how you live. And especially if you are walking in love, acceptance, and forgiveness. Pattern that for your kids, and that will be an incredible legacy that you can leave for them. A little thought for you today. From your friends here at AM 930 The Light, Edmonton's Positive Talk. Yeah.